What's up guys, Rich Gamer here. Welcome back to more Wind Waker. In the last part, we got the grappling hook from Metley, who didn't deserve it. And now I'm just chilling up against the wall. But it's time to go back to work. Go back to the business. Ah, I forgot already how to play the game. It's just so weird to me that you get to use the other stick when you got the, all the buttons right here in the center. It's just like, ugh, now I gotta move my hand up to two centimeters. <laughs> oh my goodness, if I could sound any more like a valley, like a 90210 person, I, I would. But anyway, I'm just going to move right along to here and see, if, not commentate about anything about what I'm doing right now, which is awesome. Like, really awesome. Alright, now right here, we have this little fight on the bridge. This one moblin, and he was really weak. I didn't even show the second part of the grappling hook. That was done with me. But, um, I'm gonna dodge that guy. But here's the second part of the grappling hook. You can grab any treasure that any enemy drops instantly. Like, there's a 100% ratio that you will get it. Now with that grappling hook. So there's no really need to like start worrying about grinding enemies. Well, you can grind enemies a little bit, but basically any qualms about not getting a certain item that you want when oh, come on jump I I'm gonna jump up and down come on break okay oh there we go I had just about given up <laughs> anyway let's go ahead and grab this chest right here and I hope this is what I wanted it to be oh. joy pendant which is no longer necessary to be grinding from chests because I have a way to grab them thank you Nintendo you really know how to tick me off. I mean, help me out when I need it the most. Alright, now right here, you want to get a perfect spin attack, but you want to make sure you don't hit a rope first. If you don't do that, no! <laughs> I like how I, I was like, you want to make sure you do this, because if you don't, and like it exactly <laughs> what I was trying to warn you that was going to happen, it happened. So a quick spin attack actually was better. And now we gotta wait for it to finish up. Doing its thing, you know. Just waiting. People waited, waiting, yep. waiting on the world to change. Oh, but anyway. <laughs> I like how I just let that go two seconds before it ended. Uh, nothing up there. I thought there was something up there. Wait a minute. I know what's up here. Is it Scumbag's brother? Nope, Scumbag's brother's not here. Alright, but anyway, right here. Because anyway seems to be a good word to say. God, come on, man. It's really hard with this because you want to hold it like you do for any other Zelda game where you use an item. You want to hold the button. Hold it. But you end up like freaking forgetting that you have to use the stick. So you're just sitting there like, oh, maybe I could see. I'm doing it again. And I have to move my thumb all the way over, man. I need to stop complaining about this because it's, it's getting monotonous for me, too. <laughs> but I'm just trying to let you, like, show where I'm coming from and why I'm acting like I look so retarded when I'm doing uh, excuse me, idiotic. I can't believe I said it. I'm so, I'm so sorry for that. I don't even know what's flying out of my mouth right now. But anyway. So I gotta move... <laughs> I'm never gonna get used to that Nintendo. Why? Why did you screw that up? You screwed up bad. It would be it. Anyway. Because anyway is a good word right now. Where is my centipede? There you are. I need you. I need you, man. The whole world needs you. And you need to stop being a, so selfish. And let me hit you in the face with my sword. Stop being selfish. There you go. Look at that! What do you know? You got the... I wonder what could be in here. You know, it's a very fancy looking chest. So, uh, I think it might be the... Oh, it is! The big key. Yes. The one with the eye on it. Which is really cool. I do love boss keys. That's like one of my favorite things about Zelda games. It's just the look of boss keys. Because you feel like you accomplished so much once you picked it up. It's... Uh, 
Nintendo. <laughs> I know I shouldn't complain about it, but it's, it's seriously like it's busting my jives, man. All right, let's hit this guy, and I'm on fire. Come on, get out. All right, there you go. Get out of here, fire. Throw that right there. Let's see, I'm so glad they took out the stop thing. They did that right. I love you, Nintendo, for doing that. I also love you for what? 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 Apparently, I was supposed to climb up. Once again, Nintendo, you, you, you shunned me. And now I'm doing the thumb thing again. I need to stop complaining about that, man. I need to find better stuff to talk about. Anyway. Oh, my goodness. Oof. So, after this level, I was thinking about um, some of the things because my guide that I'm using has me going around running every place. Well, I was thinking about how I should do it, go about that. Because I've had... <laughs> I'm not too familiar with the game. Like, I know where stuff is. Like, some stuff is and some stuff isn't. But, like, figurines, he, he got me lost. Even though I'm just basically spoiling the game right there. I'm trying to find stuff to talk about, so I might as well tell the rest of the game. I'm like, ugh. Oh. Spoiler alert. Alright, anyway. I don't want to die. Please don't kill me. We can talk about this. We can talk about this. We can talk about how I'm going to hit you in the face. Hit you with the sword you can. Right in the face. Right. No, no, no. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I didn't mean to kill your cousin. He was just staring at me all weird, man. He had this weird twitch in his eye. Like he, like he wanted to do something that he might regret. Like I did. <laughs> anyway, let's go back up here. And before we go to the boss, oh my god, darn it, where, alright sir, oh no, no, <laughs> I'm burning to death, <laughs> oh you lucky bat, dear Mr. Editor, warts make this cut very short, <laughs> anyway, yeah, now we're here in the boss room, I really don't want to open the door yet, because I'm pretty sure I'm missing something, pretty sure I'm missing something, I just I can't help but shake this feeling that I'm, oh, okay, that wasn't what I was looking for. But you know what? I'll take you. Get out of here, man. I'm ignoring you on purpose. There you go. I'm pretty sure I'm missing something. I'm gonna check my guide. Okay, hold on. What's this? Ah, oh, that's new. Oh, it's a knight's crest. Oh, it's, yeah. We'll get, I'll explain where that comes from later on. But, um... Yeah, I don't, can't get this. I can't help but shake this feeling that I'm missing a uh, treasure chart. Oh yeah, I know exactly where it's at. I totally know this dungeon. I know what I'm doing. I think. All right, but anyway, <laughs> I might fast forward to where that is because it's a lot of backtracking. I mean, a lot. Like, I have to go back through this room, and if I fast forward, I should be talking like in my passport. Like, oh crap! And I do stupid stuff like that, man. It's like, what the heck am I doing? You know what? I'm gonna hit the warp. And what well, the warp's not here, genius. Warp's back there. I mean, you don't know where stuff is. You just came from this room. Oh, jeez. You're disgracing Wind Waker fans all everywhere. Oh, goodness. Alright, so, um, yeah. I'm gonna ignore these guys. They're taking my butt a little bit earlier because I was trying to ignore them. And they're just like, no, I'm not having that, man. Not having that. Alright, so we're gonna go through, I think it was here. It's gonna be going right. Yes, it was here because I remember I, I, was, I passed and I was like, ah, oh, man, I could totally do this. I can't do it off camera. I mean, but. Like, I'd just be all like, oh, hey, I got this. But yeah, here's the treasure chart right here. It's right in the open. Well, not in the open. It's right off. It's right off the path, basically. And it's perfect for when you have to like when you stop recording and just like, oh, there it is. Just remember. I don't even know. I probably sound like a stupid chipmunk right now. I don't know what to say. I'm just kind of like no balling it, winging everything. Just uh, what should I say? I should just say catchphrases. Like, just shaders everywhere. There we go. The moon is a cheese. There we go. There you go. Stuff like that. Um, let's see, we're gonna go through right here. Jump right up there. And then, and then, <laughs> just going through the motions, man. What the heck is this? Alright, get that fair. Because we need. Okay, I was worried there for a second. But, um, yeah, let's go fight the boss. And let's see how painful this will be. Maybe it has, well, should have, like, a freaking death counter. But, um, anyway, no. I don't want to do that, because that would be ridiculous. 
And watch I don't die and there'd be no reason to have a death counter. <laughs> and there I go getting cocky. I'm writing checks that my body can't cash. My ego's writing checks that my body can't cash. Who's this? I just remember seeing that trailer every single time. <laughs> like when this game was coming out or in the time this game was out. Especially in, um, oh no. Get out of here. Alright. And we're running Indiana Jones over this guy. <laughs> I love his face. <laughs> it was amazing. Oh my goodness. And that falls. And I just spoiled like two seconds ahead. In case you didn't know that falls, it falls. <laughs> there we go. Oh, and he's dead. Ah, oh, man. Oh, oh, what the heck? I just got hit by a straight ember. That's really cheap. Alright. And no help from that, of course. The good thing about having a fairy is you got three extra hearts, jerk. Mr. Rude Pants, or Miss Rude Pants. Uh, isn't it, isn't the queen, isn't it queen Gomba? I don't know. Oh, okay, jump right into the lava, that's the best idea. <laughs> I like how they <laughs> landed on the land in the middle of the cutscene. That was amazing. Alright, and now we got one heart. Alright, so I'm just going to run around. Because, you know, why not? Enjoy that. What the heck? I'm going to figure out what's burning me. This is burning. This burned me up. It's grinding my gear, man. Hey, jeez. This fight should be more easier than I'm making. I mean, it's the first freaking boss of Zelda. Of Zelda! Alright. The armor should be broken by now, because, you know, three is a magic number. Yes, it is. It's a magic number. Because three always happens to be the number that things happen. You ever notice that in games? It's always three. Mario 3. <laughs> and in fact, Mario 3 was a good game. Okay. And I got hit. But I'm not worried about it. Okay. So that's how fairies work. Okay. Now it's time to panic. Alright. Hit that. Hit his face a couple of times. What is his eye? I can't even tell. What is your face? I mean, unless your face only has an eye in the mouth. And then, if that's the case, I would go to where you got that, the bargain sale, and just like trade it for another face. Trade it in for equal value or less. But yeah, nonchalantly being the boss, as usual, just relaxing. His head came off. See, I told you he was going to exchange it. Look at that. Oh, well, it blew up now. I guess you can't exchange that. You can't exchange damaged goods. I know. I tried before. <laughs> anyway. We beat our first boss. It's an amazing. And you get to hear Majora's Mask wind music, I think. I don't know. I can't hear. Because my headphones won't. <laughs> like, the freaking gamepad won't put out audio for this game if I'm using a pro controller. Unless I was using a gamepad, which I wouldn't want to use a gamepad. But, uh, yeah. I think actually I'm going to end the video off right here so when we start off next video we'll do like story plot related stuff because yeah I think that would be a good place to end. and if this video is short I'm sorry I, there's a lot of cutting and stuff like that I had to cut stuff cuts hurt kids by the way um so if you like my stuff why not comment favorite like subscribe via red try if you like to do that follow me on my channel if you like to do that also or you can do none of the above and just be you know you if you want be you, I'll be me. But you'd be better you if you did those above. And when we come back next time, I already, I already said all that, didn't I? So this has been the Retro Gamer signing out.